بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم رب شرح لی صدری و یسر لی عمری وحل العدت ملی ثانی یفق ہو گولی السلام علیکم فسٹ ایئر اسٹوڈنٹس ٹو ڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو اسٹارٹ دا پوئم لولیسٹ آف ٹریز دا چیری ناؤ بائی اے ای ہاؤس مین ہاؤس مین ریمینس اے پاپولر انگلش پوئٹ whose first volume of poems, uh, Shropshire Lad, was a favorite book among young male soldiers fighting in the Great War. The book was a bestseller and poems like Loveliest of Trees with their sense of wistfulness at the brevity of human life and the quickness with which one year gives way to another are among the most emblematic poem in this book. 63 poem collection love dear of tree is then something of a cap dime poem using us to seize the day and enjoy life while we can and also like many of a e hosman's poems something of a memento mori i e a reminder that we are going to die some day These two meanings softly provide a backdrop to House Pen's description of the lad walking along the woodland ride, a ride being a path meant for horses and admiring the white cherry blossoms on the trees. The poem's setting of Easter time, Easter, Easter tide, reminds us of the spring time when the cherry comes into blossoms. but the whiteness of the cherry trees wearing white at easter is a christian tradition here nature seems to have adopted the custom also suggests purity fresh beginnings and rebirth things associated with spring time and rebirth obviously being a central part of the easter story and since to look at things in bloom 50 springs are the little room about the woodland i will go to see the cherry hung with snow the metaphorical description of the white cherry blossom as snow in the poem last line reinforces this idea of fresh starts snow being a popular symbol for purity for washing things clean This paves the way for the poem message that the speaker will adopt a new approach to life and try to make the most of the 50 years fifty years he estimate he has remaining on this planet. Loveliest of Trees offers in the last analysis a fresh take on an old message. the idea that our time is short on this planet was not original to a e hosman of course but this but his focus on a particular phenomena glimpsed for only a short time during the year brings home the fact to us 50 years left on this planet may seem like quite a generous number to a young man but only 50 more chances to see the cherry trees like this one final note on this poem may help to pinpoint a reason for the perennial popularity of hosman his poetry is technically accomplished if not in innovative here he uses quatrains of rhyming couplet a a b b and iambic tetrameter although the opening lines of the poem loveliest of trees led us in with a strong heavy stress and a trochaic substitute one wonders whether robert frost had this poem in mind when he wrote his stopping by woods on a snowy evening a poem a poem also featuring trees and quite little 
literal snow using iambic tetrameter quatrains. At least not the chief reason. There is a strong mixture of wistfulness and stoicism in his poetry, which gives the lie to the idea that he is depressing our self-pitying poet. There is plenty of unrequited love and untimely death in Houseman's poetry, but the first is often tempered by the knowledge that true love survives being buffed by one by the one we love. As a poem like because I liked you better demonstrates and the later by a seeking by sneaking suspicions that dying young is the best way that is better to burn out than fade away. In other words, Houseman's outlook is far more stoic, stoic than many people believe. And the final stanza of Loveliest of Trees, the cherry now nicely captured this as the Shropshire lad resolves to make the most of his narrow span. His three score years and ten are at least the two score and ten that remain to him and enjoy what the world and the world of nature has to off offer him during the time remaining to him. Okay, beta, it's a brief introduction of the poet. In the next lecture, we will read the poem. Okay, Allah Hafiz.